up you guys welcome back to my channel so uh we're totally like on our way out to a party but i just wanted to stop really quick and tell you guys a super uh weird story or m most of most for inform you of what's going on with these amazon packages that people have been receiving um around and what you can do to not get scammed and stuff because something similar is happening is happening to me just now so about uh, a week and a half ago or so, my sister calls me and tells me that I received the package. And I've been waiting for this vlogging camera for, for like a week. And I'm like, oh yes, it finally got here. It got here before the day expected and stuff. So I didn't really question it until later. She was like, hey, uh, so why'd you order this? Or she was like, probably like asking me something why I had ordered that. And I was like, well, what do you mean I want it? I've been wanting to like use it. And we didn't really like tell each other what we were talking about. But then later she like, when we were like video chatting and stuff, she's like, uh, so this is what you wanted really bad? And I was like, what are you talking about? What's that? This is like, so, it was like a sort of like Christmas wrapping paper, like a big sticker or like a backdrop. Not sure exactly what it was, but it was just like a big tube of some sort of fabric or paper. And she's like, that, yeah, it's a package that came from Amazon. And I totally never ordered anything from Amazon. So I was super tripped out and... I was like, what are you talking about? No. And then she's like, yes, this has your name. It came from to our address. Why, why would you order this? Or why did you order it to our address rather than your address? And I was like, dude, I never ordered anything. What's going on? So I didn't really do much about it because I was like, well, that's weird. Maybe somebody will come and claim the package or something was going to happen. But no, nothing happened. And then the next week, yesterday, she calls me and she tells me, hey, you got another package from Amazon. I'm like, okay, this is so weird what's going on i didn't order anything from amazon i've never even created an account in amazon i ordered something once for my boyfriend's account like months back but that was my boyfriend's account it, and it wasn't even that address so it was so weird that they would have my full name my address and the way that it was written it's like how i write it because it, it has to be the p.o box and the actual mailing address street in the same thing because that's how they want it in that p.o box center so it was super weird because they definitely like scammed or they managed to hijack me from some other place and so i totally freaked out and i was like sister what are you talking about i never ordered it what is it she's like it's a hat it's it was the ugliest i've ever seen by the way it was so bad and i was super scared and i didn't know what to do so i started researching it and talking to my co-workers and they were like yeah this has been happening to other people as well i'm like what are you talking about it's because these people what are they they're doing is they're getting gift cards buying packages and sending them out to random addresses to improve their ratings in amazon and therefore they would get like higher stars or whatever they use and they would like be trusted sellers or they would start floating around in the top pages and stuff so that their business can prosper or so that's what I was research reading in the research I was doing and I was also like looking at videos of people that it's happened to and so I was super freaked out because these people are saying that they've packages have been coming non-stop and they can't do anything about it it's super freaky like who would not get scared of that and so I was like I definitely don't want this happening to me this is the second time I need to stop it right now so I called Amazon and or they're like main number and stuff and so they told me that this shouldn't happen again but that this this packages that I have received that there was nothing they can do to take them back because I didn't have an account so they couldn't create a returning label but what do you mean like that's so weird you're literally telling me that like, this is a common thing like people receive packages for free all the time and so he was like not even freaking out a, a little bit and I was like super freaked out more freaked out that like, he wasn't freaking out and so yeah but he was super like nice and everything and like trying to get to know what's going on and research the things and stuff but what was I going to say? Where, oh, yeah. yeah, but this shouldn't even happen because I was there for, like, a good 20 minutes on my work hours. People were, my coworkers like, dude, like, it's taking a long time. Like, you need to come to work. I was super frustrating. I'm definitely not going to call them in my free time because, no, fuck no. If I didn't order them, why should I be dealing with it? Like, I wasn't, like, really busy, so I just called during my work time because I got stuff to do. Like, what's going on? Why are you guys not, like, you know, keeping your system safe to people and so i am really like freaked out at the moment still because i don't know if it's going to continue to happen he said it shouldn't which means he didn't say it's not going to happen he said it shouldn't so i'm still like whoa what's going on but anyways i just totally wanted to come and tell you guys what's going on and with these packages 
Um, yeah, definitely check your bank accounts. He, like, made sure that nothing was charged to my bank account, especially since I've never inputted it to an account to my name. Um, but yeah, totally research. If something like this happens to you, call them right away. So that way you have like somewhere to start or you can have something to defend yourself. You know, later if they don't do anything about it, then you can like sue them or whatever. But yeah, super scary in the world that we live in because we're putting our information in and out. We don't know what's going to happen to it. We want to buy something online. We don't know if somebody else is going to get access to it. So just definitely like make sure to keep checking your bank statements. Know that everything's okay. You know, just we just gotta keep ourselves informed, and that's what I'm here for. I just totally want to inform you guys of what's going on, and yeah, I hope you guys found something um, informative. I hope you guys found something informative about this, and yeah, if something like this happening to you, let me know down below. And um, sorry guys, it's, it's happening to you guys, but this is the world we live in now. Um, yeah, see you guys in the next one. Bye. We will let you know where it is. Okay, wait. Daddy, we're, we're gonna be here forever. Yeah. No, hold on, hold on. Let me see. Party, party time. Party, party, party time. Party. Hey, give me a beat. Give me a beat. Diego, give me a beat. That's fucked up. Give me a beat. That's fucked up.